Kia Development Corporation has established 38 years in the real estate industry. In terms of pag-ibig housing loan takeout, Axia ranked top 3 developer last 2019 and top 2 developer last year. Art, lifestyle, convenience, it's all in one place. One Tandang Sora Place is located at 353 Tandang Sora Avenue, Barangay Kulyat, and we are in the heart of Quezon City. The project is near malls, parks, universities, hospitals, and the future Solaire North Casino that will give high rental demand for POGOs and BPO workers. We are near at the MRT Night 7 Tandang Sora Station in the future, New Metro Manila Subway Tandang Sora Station. This is a one-tower building. It has 16 floors with a total of 305 residential units. We have four levels of podium parking with gentle sloping ramp access. The main lobby and commercial area are located at the ground floor. All of the amenities are located at the fifth floor. We have swimming pools, co-working spaces, gym, function room, game room, children play area, open landscape areas, and the building is equipped with CCTV camera, one bedroom, two bedroom, and a few garden units. An old studio unit with a floor area of 21.84 square meter. So this is dressed up just to give you an idea on how you will interior design the unit. Part of the unit upon turnover is the granite countertop, overhead cabinet, the complete finish of toilet and The living or bed area and modular cabinet is also in. With a floor area of 36.92 square meter. So, this is the kitchen area, the dining area, and the living area. So, this is the modular cabinet. So, this is the toilet and bath. The good thing is, meron ng access to bed area sa kali area. So we have a flexible payment terms. Down payment is payable for 42 months at 0% interest and the balance will go to bank or pag-ibig financing. Come visit us here at the showroom every day from Monday to Sunday, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. See you! And what's up? Yan, dito naman tayo sa Baras. Yan yung project naman ngayon dito nagagawin ng housing. Yan, explain niya sa inyo guys. Yung computation, ang pinagbabasihan namin is yung nasa Pampanga kasi same lang po siya. Same lang ang mga units. Sa Pampanga kasi ganun din eh. May talit rin. Salat area lang nagkatalo ma'am. Kasi sa Pampanga, 107 po eh. Dito po kasi nasa 85 lang talaga siya. Lord area niya yun. Lord area niya is 34. And then, ano po yun? May ready pin, may poste. So, ready for second floor po siya. Pwede po tayong, dito kasi hindi naman mahigpet tulad na ibang subdivision na bawal kang mag-renovate, bawal nang baguhin yung bahay mo. Dito po pwede. Pwede pwede po siya. Pero, kailangan naka-2 years muna tayo ng payment kaya pag-ibig before tayo mag-reconstruct ng ating bahay. So, any any ano any expansion, pwede. Kung gusto niyo sakupin yung buong area nyo, pwede. Pero, upon turnover, uh, ang magagawa pa lang natin is pakuran muna ang ating uh, property line. Hindi pa tayo pwedeng mag-expand. Ano uh, Adeline po. Adeline. 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 Adeline
Sir, ano ang malapit dito ang hospital? Hospital na pinakamalapit natin dito ang patuloy. Ano? Pero alam ko meron din dito sa may... Hindi ko bago lang siya. Kaya talaga ako yung Pampanga. Saan? Ano malapit ma'am? Saan? Saan? Sa Baras meron din. Buso po sa meron din. Ayun yung pinakamalapit. Uh, as I've heard, uh, yung kabila niyan is under under negotiation na rin. Ito yung bagawin project. Baras. So ayun, may book sa ating... Uh, This view is Royal. This is our subdivision here. What is this view? This is Royal. This subdivision consists of low-cost and economic housing. So, we have three classes here. The units or model units. There are low-cost, economic. So, we have three classes. But we have three units. We have Tangerine, Adelaide, and Jasmine. The Tangerine is our row house. It's our house. No, raw house po siya. Pero hindi siya yung typical yung sampung dikit-dikit, bente, quadruplex lang po siya. So, sa bawat uh, apat, meron tayong dalawang uh, end, tas dalawang inner. So, yung inner natin, 45 square meter siya. Yung end naman po natin is 62 square meter. Depende na lang kung yung end natin ay napatapat sa corner. Possible na mas, yes, possible na mas, uh, mas mawak pa. O, mas magka pa yung ating lot area, no? So, sa ngayon po, uh, ito po ay pre-selling, pero wala, hindi po po talaga siya officially open for sale. No. Opo, wala pa po tayong binebenta ang unit dito talaga. Ang expected, opo, ang expected po natin dito na launching is this month or by September, final last last call na yung September, no? Last call. Uh, kasi we're, we're waiting for dano na lang po eh for uh, development permit o yung construction permit natin para makapag-develop tayo dito. Yan na lang naman hinihintay natin. And then mga kapag- uh, Saan kayo? May lang di siya tapos there's talaga. Oo. Oh, okay. Talaga niyan, dapat. Marami na expected eh. Yung expectations kung kanyang talaga dapat yung kanyang Uh, okay. Dodgy, pero uh, kung ano yung sigurado is magkakaroon, ma-open po talaga siya. Yun ang sigurado. Dapat last, last month o end of last month dapat yung launching pero, anyway, pero last na magiging final date nila dyan is September. September last na yun. Wala nang extension pa mag-launching na talaga sila. No? So ayun, uh, si Baras po consist po siya ng uh, socialized and economic housing. No? And then uh, meron tayong tatong klase ng Ayunis uh, dyan, uh, yung ating socialized o yung ating tangerine rock ako. So yung 633,000 po siya. Loan value niya sa pag-ibig is 580. Reservation rate 3,000. Total cash outlay 50,000. Monthly cash outlay or cut yung down payment for 15 months is uh, 3,333. Ayan. And then, kanyang monthly amortization sa pag-ibig for 30 years po ito ha, 3,618. Kung ikaw ay below minimum, which is 12,000 pa baba ang sakot mo, ito po ay 2,445 lang. Kung below minimum po ha, pero kung above minimum po tayo, ito po ang magiging monthly natin. Ibig sabihin, pag below minimum, pasok pa rin. Pasok pa rin po. Ang below minimum natin is nasa 8,000 to 12,000. Ayan yung manon.